So this is how you download your microbit program so that you can submit it for a grade. So with your rock, paper, scissors assignment, you're going to submit your .hex file, which is the file that I can pull up and it'll then show me your program and what you did. Uh, you'll use this on other assignments as well. So I'm going to make sure I show you the process. So I've got my completed program here. And notice down here, I named it. That's one key thing. You want to make sure you always add a name to your program so that um, you know what it is. Otherwise, you'll have Untitled 1, Untitled 2, Untitled 3, Untitled 4, and it'll get really confusing. I would also suggest and would like if you would add in your last name. So do Myers dash and then whatever it's called. So that when you submit your program, I know whose is whose. So I know that this is my program because it's Myers Dash and I know it's my rock, paper, scissors program. So once you've got it named, then you either click on download or the save button. Either way works. So I'm going to click on download and then you're going to pick where you're going to save it. So in this case, I'm going to save it to my downloads folder. If you're on a Chromebook, um, you can pick whatever folder. It may actually on a Chromebook, it'll probably automatically save it to the files or the downloads folder. Um, if you are saving these to your Google Drive and you have Google Drive installed, you can save it directly there or you'll just upload it to your Google Drive later. Um, but I would suggest doing that. That way you have copies of all your programs. But anyways, here's downloads. Um, I'm going to go ahead and hit save. So now I have that program saved. Now in this other window, this is how you actually submit it. You've submitted lots of assignments by now, but I just wanna make sure you know, this is my son's dummy account or my dummy class that my son's in. So when it's time to actually submit your program, this is how you do it. First you download that docs .hex file, and then up here on your work, you wanna hit add or create, and then file, and then you're going to have to upload. So you're going to select files from your device. Unless, of course, you have it saved in your drive, then you can pick it straight from your drive. But in this case, I have to select files from my device. And then I'm going to go to my downloads folder. And right there, that's my microbit, myers-rockpaperscissors.hex. And I'm going to select that file. So this is the .hex file that I saved earlier. And then I will hit upload. And now you'll see right here it says microbit dash Myers dash rock dash paper dash scissors. <clears throat> and then it says binary file. And that's what it should be. If you hover over it, you'll see it's a dot hex. And then you go ahead and hit turn in. It'll double check, make sure your file is there. As long as the file is there, you're good. Hit turn in. And you will be good to go. So today with your rock, paper, scissors assignment and in your future microbit programs, you're going to actually be submitting your .hex file. And then on my side, I can actually open up that .hex file and see all of your code and be able to run the simulation and know exactly how well it works. So that's how you do it. If you have any questions, please reach out and hope you have a wonderful day.